say hello to YouTube. Wow, I, I just love the feeling of this new controller. Here is the new controller. It's a wired, I gotta use wired. It's a wired galaxy colored Xbox controller. This one, I like the heaviness of this one. It's just got this little drift. a bunch of new stuff here field research on his entity his corrupted ranger airborne this subgroup of his corrupted rangers has manifested the ability to levitate similarly to, similarly to his elevated agents however these airborne his rangers display no telekinetic abilities and simply continue to use mundane bureau weaponry this evolution being so similar to the elevated possibly indicated that his can share permutations through a type of network or perhaps osmosis however the fact that this development in his rangers has only been observed in the investigation sector may indicate that an environmental factor is responsible what is that Perhaps this is the natural progression of the His Ranger phenotype. Not enough time has passed to determine a conclusive trajectory of development for each of the His manifestations, assuming any such trajectory exists. Refer to file mm, for full report. I posted something on Reddit. It's getting responses. My phone's about to blow up, I think. That better not happen, dude. Come on. For some time now, there has been a steady increase in the annual number of AWEs that the Bureau responds to. Between 2010 and 2013, we responded to... Mm, AWEs for comparison. Note that we only responded to mm, between 1995 and 2005. Okay, these are the, the what are they called? Altered world events. Is this a result of mm, improvement in our detection procedures or perhaps simply a coincidence? We cannot say for sure, which is why this proposal for an AWE task force to be created within the hierarchy of the investigation sector has been compiled. We need to spend more time examining what causes AWEs rather than just containing them. Refer to file 595-1737 for full report. Yes, sir. A black market hub specializing in the trade of occult talismans, relics, and other assorted... Wait, what is it? Illegal altered item market. Okay, a black market hub specializing in the trade of occult talismans, relics, and other assorted ceremonial objects, as well as genuine altered and paranatural materials was raided in Czech Republic by a team of special investigators. Unsuccessful attempts by suspects to escape using altered items resulted in numerous casualties and prevented the Bureau from questioning all participants. The following interrogations revealed that not only is there a vast network of these retailers, but that they seem to be gathering information on altered items and other paranatural materials from sources unknown to the Bureau. The Bureau's concerns here is threefold. There is a growing underground market for paranatural materials, which implies a growing awareness of their existence among a niche group of the general public. B. These criminals and individuals do not seem aware of the item's paranatural powers, and their attempts to activate them could prove devastating if done in populated areas. C. The motivations of these collectors are largely unknown. How about someone within the Bureau is, is giving the information? Could that be it? Paracriminal Profile, the Blessed Organization. This group slash individual has operated outside of the Bureau's notice for decades, perhaps longer, displaying a level of skill and caution rarely seen in paracriminal groups. A review of past cases has found various mentions of their activity over the years. In 2016, a production company called Blessed Pictures was connected to an altered item case as well as the death of an agent from exposure to illicit paranatural materials. In 1994, a Los Angeles-based public speaker named Chester Bless was involved in the illegal use of an altered item. 
something just boomed in my ear. I think it's my neighbors. I don't think it's the game. Okay. It's interesting. In 1988, a business called Bless... So, here we go. Here's all the mentions of Bless. In 2016, Bless Pictures was connection to an owner. Death of an agent from exposure to illicit. Okay, 1994. LA-based public speaking speaker Chester, Chester Bless was involved in the illegal use of an altered item. Okay. In 88, a business called Blessed Repair and Blessed... Blessed Repair and Blessed Service? Or Blessed Repair and Service. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, I was looking at something. Was suspected of involvement with an object of power case, perhaps even creating it. None of these businesses or individuals have ever been located. However, the connection to appearances of altered items and objects of power is too direct to be considered circumstantial. An arrest order has been issued for any persons believed to be involved in the BLESS organization. Darling Investigation. Per authorization from Mr. Kirkland, Internal Investigation DO-845 was launched into the ethical practices of Dr. Casper Darling, Head of Research. Despite the accounts of anonymous mm, regarding inhumane treatment of a mm, currently housed in the Bureau, our official findings regarding this were inconclusive. Numerous obstacles arose during this investigation. The majority of mm, sector personnel seemed to be wholly unaware of any such mm, contained there. One mm, confirmed the mm's code name to be mm, but all files pertaining to that name were inaccessible, being classified under the highest clearance level. Investigators were similarly blocked from entering the mm, research wing to interview its staff. The matter was further complicated by the lack of clarity on whether non-human paranatural entities warrant humane treatment. While this investigation cannot address any charges against Dr. Darling, we do recommend an investigation into mm, research. Refer to file 982-0136 for full report. We're going to have a few things to read today, friends. I apologize. I collected a lot of stuff last time. The Prime Candidate Program. Okay. Per authorization from Mr. Kirkland, Internal Investigation P-1429 was launched into the legality of the Prime Candidate Program mm, by the Federal, Federal Bureau of Control. Since all known subjects relevant to the investigation used ex executive privilege to decline interviews, very little first-hand information was gathered. However, anonymous sources and documentation declassified by Mr. Kirkland both paint an alarmingly clear picture of systematic mm, kind of mm, mm, or brought to the oldest house and placed under mm, examination and testing with the aim of appointing one as director upon maturity. This program has produced no successful cases and only resulted in the traumatic mm, of paranaturally inclined mm, not only is this in breach of the Ash Act, but it lies in the face of basic human mm, this investigative team unequivocally mm, the prime candidate program and recommends that it be mm, immediately denounces and terminated, probably. Oh no. Um, official arrest report. Emil Hartman. Arrested. Victim names. Alan Wake. Tor Anderson. Odin Anderson. Elaine mm, Rudolph. Dessel Wendy. Emerson Thomas. Mm, officer names. Dennis. Special Agent Remy. Okay, charges. Code 4, kidnapping of altered individuals, one count. Um, sanctions against altered organizations, one count. Obstruction of bureau investigation, one count. Breaching the Ash Act, six counts. Offenders properly seized as evidence to be used in conjunction with an ongoing AWE investigation. Offenders personal effects, property seized as a personal effects have been sent to research for analysis. After being cleared by Bureau researchers, all victims have been released. Biannual surveillance orders. Uh, hold on. 
biannual surveillance orders were assigned to each except the Anderson brothers due to their sen senility and Wake possibly deceased. Seriously? Alan Wake be dead? Following the NASA FBC coordination agreement of 1972, the Bureau has provided NASA with numerous technological advancements based on our research, including the black rock lining now found in all space faring vessels. In return, all data gathered during space missions is made available for Bureau researchers to analyze. Recently, certain individuals have raised the concern that this relationship does not adequately benefit the Bureau, either intellectually or financially. A thorough examination of the costs accrued by both organizations has shown that the expense of NASA's recent launch of the mm, far outweighs any spending related to the processing and delivery of Black Rock. From its medium Earth orbit, the mm, will provide the Bureau with an unparalleled resource for remotely monitoring and photographing AWE sites. A resource that would be lost if the partnership ends. It, it is the opinion of this committee that maintaining a cooperative relationship with our colleagues at NASA is of vital importance. Holy shit. Friends with NASA. Internal confidential. Okay. There's an incident. The purpose of internal investigation X0397 is to examine the containment failure of specimen SI1. That resulted in the deaths of mm, agents. That looks like double digits. An inspection report of the containment equipment three days earlier showed no faults. Investigators suspect human error to be the cause, yet no department has provided any evidence to, show, to support this. Technicians were able to recover the researchers' notes on the specimen from the internal network. On the mm, of mm, the specimen began displaying a sharp increase in aggressive mm, cross-referencing the date with various logs, found only two events in inconsistent with the sector's daily routines. One, the air filters were changed. Two, an air hour prior to the incident, a civilian named Alice mm, entered the sector regarding an unrelated incident. Given their connection to the same ADBUE case, it is likely that Mrs. Mm's presence is relevant to the specimen's escape and to the mm, investigation ongoing. The shadow. The final one of this section. Paranatural entity A010 or A10, aka the shadow, is an aggressive mm, consisting of three known types. Type A, localized manifestations of sentient mm, capable of occupying organic and inorganic material, as well as exerting mm, over its surroundings. Shaded individuals, human bodies mm, by the shadow. These individuals become notably more aggressive, but do seem to retain mm, of their previous selves. Research is ongoing as to whether this condition is reversible. Type C, shaded objects. Similar to type B, except that inanimate objects are mm, solely to be used as destructive tools. Each type seems to work towards a shared goal, possibly a tar targeting certain individuals, see AWE 35, which may imply a shared link to a mm, intelligence. The threat this entity poses warrants immediate exploration of offensive defensive measures. The investigation sector is being outfitted with additional lighting sources, some internally powered to prepare for the eventuality of an mm, don't understand what I'm reading half the time Eagle Limited summary the Eagle Limited okay a train derailment resulting in 62 casualties and numerous injuries was suspected to have been the work of a paracriminal group known as mm. as a result of this event the agents discovered that one of the cars had become altered with a persistent auditory event um, it remains to be determined whether the AWE was spontaneous or the direct result of the sabotage. Um, event response. I don't want that. The Bureau had been tracking said group at the time, and the intel gathered and suggested an event of this caliber was imminent in Bloomington. As a result, a response team on site was able to respond to the train accident site within minutes of its occurrence. Let me turn my phone on to do not disturb mode. Uh, they arrived to find emergency process was underway, but also equipment left behind by the suspected group. A suspicious onlooker managed to elude agents after they attempted to make contact. 
Further investigations of the accident site revealed a curiously damaged train car that exhibited an altered state when entered. This individual car was secured and transported to the investigation sector for further studies. Mannequin procedures. Ooh, the mannequin. We already did this. The, we fought it. No known procedures for preventing the item's effect. Lining the item cell with newly discovered black rock has yielded positive results. Test with other altered items. A wire and fabric waist mannequin, the base and head are made of stained wood. The item duplicates. The trigger for this behavior is unknown. No correlation can be found in either the number of duplications that manifest during an episode or the duration for which they last before disappearing. Um, no unique procedure required. Altered status is suspected but unverified. A plastic pink flamingo lawn ornament, two steel prongs extended from its underside. The item is suspected to influence at atmospheric physics, altering meteorological phenomena in the area. The effect is currently unconfirmed. Appendix. New altered item has been observed. Okay. Burrow tractor. Item is not in Bureau custody. None known. A Frank Elk tractor, olive green, dried blood on the grill when last seen. Item is capable of vocalized responses or growls and unmanned locomotion. Considered highly aggressive and dangerous. Cool. Background. The item first came to the Bureau's attention after the death of William Burrow, owner of Burrow Farm outside of the Trenton, Texas. Of Trenton, Texas. Local authorities arrived on scene after an employee found the mutilated body of Mr. Burrow beneath his tractor. Police arrived but were immediately driven away by the tractor. Panicked calls to federal authorities were intercepted by Bureau communication staff. A team was dispatched. Um, upon arrival, the agents approached the item. It responded by growling like a bear. Three agents were injured when they tried to detain the item, which escaped. Aerial searches for the item are ongoing. Speaking to Mrs. Burrow only revealed that she had a domestic altercation with Mr. Burrow earlier the night of the incident. Whether these events are connected is currently unknown. Hmm. Tractor supplement. Supplementary materials. No, miscommunication led to a local coroner examining the body of William Burrow. Okay. William Burrow. Male, Caucasian. Case summary. 33-year-old man found dead on his property. Per police report, remains obtained for coroner's office also included blood, urine, bile, stomach contents, and bone fragments. Autopsy findings. Blunt force injuries. Head. Wait, lacerations. Left ear cheek. Blunt force injuries. Extremities. Dislocation. Right knee. Oof. Complete avulsion of the upper right extremity with associated fracture of proximal right knee. Extensive trauma. Abdominal region. We read something about this already. Complete avulsion of multiple organs, including stomach, heart, liver, pancreas, kidneys, and portions. Um, and a large and small intestine, all missing from the scene. Conclusion. It is my opinion that Mr. Burrow's death is not the result of a mechanical accident as claimed by authorities. The removal of organs is consistent with animal attack. Jesus Christ. It's almost been 30 minutes. I have yet to play a fucking single thing in this game. This, this game's a little full of itself. Like, come on. I... I feel like I'm I'm I enjoy lore so and I'm gonna read everything in this game because I wanna know. These things connect. A lot of these things connect and have to do with what you already seen, what you're about to see. So it's not like this lore is unimportant, but it's just very, very overwhelming. And it takes up a large portion of my stream time. I don't have that long to play. And a, a good portion of the stream is dedicated to reading. Fuck off. A Mr. Dennis, a request came through recently from an FBI agent asking for all our files on Bright Falls, specifically on the disappearance of the author Alan Wake. Per the interagency information exchange agreement, I had some paper pushers gather up a folder of all the pre approved files. Don't worry, all the inappropriate material is either missing or redacted. But I'm writing to let you know that we received this request from a special agent named Alex Casey. Sounds familiar, right? That's because Alex Casey is the name of the fictional de detective in those hard-boiled crime books Alan Wake wrote. Pretty interesting that an FBI agent sharing a name with the most famous character Wake wrote is looking into a case dealing with a writer's fiction coming true. 
I think this is worth looking into, but what's your opinion? Just give the word, and I'll start surveillance on this guy. Special Investigator Gleason. All right, we've got some missing agents. Alan Wake is very prominent in this game. Mr. Kirkland. Here are our latest agents confirmed missing. Presumed dead from the containment breach yesterday. Agent Jonathan Connor, researcher Ezra Cruz, Agent Carolina, Caroline Dempsey, Agent Lindsay Malcolm, Agent Charles Murray, Agent Derek Shock. Letters of condolence will be delivered to you to sign prior to sending them to their families. You will be updated as soon as additional confirmations are made. Also, per your request, a network engineer checked how many cases were backed up digitally. Unfortunately, a large number of active investigations were not yet were not archived yet and the only hard copies of reports exist behind the fire break. They're lost, I'm afraid. Resignation later. Okay, mm, of mm, 29. To whom it may concern, it is with great anger and regret that I tender my resignation as head of investigations for the Federal Bureau of Control. I do this in protest of the rampant disregard for my department's mm, My staff cannot continue to work in these conditions. Previous requests and warnings have fallen on deaf ears, so I must now rely on my actions to speak louder than my words ever could. I blame the situation on our mm, who has routinely ignored my requests for assistance in reclaiming the parts of the investigation sector lost to the mm, loose inside. I will never forget the screams of brave agents begging for us to open that fire break. I will carry that shame for the rest of my days. The mm, has failed his agents. I shall never forgive him for that. Sincerely, William Kirkland. Keystone inspection. Mr. Kirkland, we stopped at Keystone on our way to the target AWE, like you asked. I'm sending my report directly to you to try and keep a lid on the groom and Morales desertion issue. We didn't find any sign of them there. Given their records, it is possible they've switched teams, like you suspected. But I don't think that's the case. An event definitely occurred here at Keystone, and I think Grumman and Morales got caught up in it. The entire population has vanished into thin air. Reminds me of the ordinary case, but that was just the adults, if I'm remembering the file correctly. This is different. I think our guys are casualties, not traitors. If it was an AWE, it seems to be over. We walked through the whole town, and the only strange thing we noticed were markings on various buildings. Two overlapping circles with a dot in the shared space. Could be unrelated. I'll show you the pictures when I get back. In the meantime, you should send a team out there to cordon this place off and maybe get the comms guys working on a cover story. Sincerely, Agent Keenum. Ah, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Does this game fucking know? Does it want me to... I don't know, man. Mr. Dennis. So yes, there's an increase in AWE cases, and yes, it would be a good idea to put together a special task force to examine exactly why that is. However, it seems that a tiny little detail has slipped through the cracks. We don't have the damn staff. If you expect us to detect, investigate, and process more AWE cases, you need to give us more people. It's simple math. Between the staff we lost in the Hartman thing and the ones who left other departments after Kirkland quit, we're barely managing to keep up with the workload. Hell, just filing the paperwork for all the altered items we left behind in the sector has been an ordeal. Another thing, and this is going to sound paradoxical, but we have an overcrowding situation. This lobby isn't meant to accommodate a whole sector's worth of staff. Uh, we put forward a motion to move investigations to a more suitable location months ago. It better not still be sitting on your desk. The people are getting restless, and as Kirkland's interim replacement, it's your job to handle it. Best regards. Agent Grayson. Foot gossip. Hello. My feet gossip at night. And now I have to wear shoes to bed. Sincerely, me. My understanding of the darkness is fragmented. Okay. Incomplete. This abyss. This void. It very much does not wish to be understood. If light symbolizes knowledge, then it stands to reason that darkness would equate to ignorance. By its very nature, it abhors comprehension. Of course, my own nature drives me to comprehend all. We are opposing forces, destined to collide. Okay. And given this conflict of natures, 
We know that the light of truth will burn away the darkness, both figuratively and literally. Any significant light source can be used as protection, even weaponry against this metaphysical gloom. And then there are the artists. I know for a fact that Tom, Wake, the Anderson brothers, and Lane all had some involvement with the darkness. The question is whether their uncanny ability to affect reality through their art beckons the darkness, or did their work perhaps even create it? With Wake now secure in my lodge, I expect I shall grow closer to learning the answers to these questions. Assuming he cooperates, which is proving quite the challenge. Well, perseverance is the foundation of knowledge. Speaking of, I must be off on my rounds. Agent Fisher, day six inside the motel. Utilized surveillance methods are as follows. Fiber optic cameras slid under the individual room doors. Motion detectors in the lobby area. Tripwire, triggering a flash camera across the main entrance, even fingerprint powder on the front desk. Results are varying at best. But mostly just... inconclusive and unusable. The footage is corrupted. Sometimes even the equipment is damaged. I don't know how, exactly. I, uh... I think this place is making fun of me. That's the only explanation. I can hear them, laughing and screaming behind the closed doors. I can hear the call bell go and ding multiple times a day, but when I look, there's no one there. I know I'm supposed to stay out of sight, but I've, I've seen the doors closing just before I can catch even a glimpse of anyone or anything. They're messing with me, whoever they are. I think... Wait, shh. There's something. I gotta get this. I gotta get the cable out. Come on, you fiber optic fuck. Cooperate. Okay, there we go. Oh, sorry, Mod. I was muted. Hi, Mod. Hi. All right. Sorry, I was muted because I was eating. How are you doing, Mod? Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Mod. I think I might have already I forgot to unmute myself after eating. I swear to God, I'm... Hello? I'm so silly. Who's there? I said hi. But you didn't hear it. Oh, shit. I'm with the FBC. Move away from the door. I have a... Is this Where's what? Me? Is this the creep? I asked if you were ready to see some creepy shit. But you didn't hear Darkness me. The Is elevator. this the end? No, I don't... I highly doubt it. A presence. Jesse Faden could hear it. A call. It was faint. Reaching for her from a dark place. What's going on with Ellen Wake right Aiden now? was sensitive to visitations. She had them all the time. From her guiding star and the previous director. She was the perfect receiver. As if she'd been made for this. Faden paused to feel it. The pores in play here. It was changing things. This around. is Ellen Wake. So I have an Ellen Wake trying game. To interact. Faden didn't like that. Her guide felt it too. Polaris didn't flare up in defense as with the hiss. So it wasn't all bad. Not a hostile transmission. It was powerful, but it was coming from far away. And made weak because of the distance. It was a distress call. Faden sensed a drowning man. A man desperate to escape. She sensed something else, too. A hunger in the dark. Not unlike the hostile resonance. Waiting. She knew that desperate acts can have grim consequences. It was this, more than the man's despair, that made her follow the call. The elevator lights winked back on. The darkness receded like a memory. There was a new button on the elevator control panel. Investigation sector. Faden pressed the button. The elevator doors slid shut with practice bravado. Okay. Dr. Emil Hartman was desperate. Okay, Alan Wake. The Federal Bureau of Control had stolen his life's work. Whoa. This was his last chance, his final experiment. What he'd been too scared to do before. Hartman dove into the lake, was taken. 
devoured by hungry darkness, became the thing that had been Hartman. Only an echo of him remained, fragmented impulses on autoplay, violent, bloodthirsty darkness in the driver's seat. Emerging from the lake, the thing was captured by the FBC, brought in, okay. contained, studied. The thing broke loose, killed everyone it could. The FBC fell back and sealed the sector. The thing was alone in the dark, lurking, roaming, waiting. Okay. Then something else came. Not darkness, but similar enough. A sound. A resonance. It shouldn't be a surprise. If there's one, why not another? The darkness inside the thing could have been immune, could have resisted, fought, could have been passed by, passed through with no effect. But it didn't, and it wasn't. Maybe it had grown weaker over time, not aged. It was timeless, but weaker with no huh. link to its source. A metamorphosis followed. The thing that had been Hartman went through another change. All right, the third thing, okay. The resonance carves its way through the thing that had been Hartman, vibrating, remolding. The sound changes the darkness, and the darkness changes the sound. They both change what remained of Hartman. They all turned into something else. A third thing. The sound made darker. The darkness made louder. Hartman His hair looks shorter from this angle. Stretched as anyone when seen from out of time. He, like it's like he doesn't have time. enough, like, Almost neck. An Ouroboros. Hair. A spiral. A maelstrom. The gravity well of a black hole, twisting inward, tightening, taking you deeper and deeper to the bottom, the heart, and through to the other side. What's this guy the talking about? Said, Maybe the things are out of order. You're a new you. He said, we build you till nothing remains. He said, under the conceptual reality behind this reality, you must want these ways to drag you away. He said, baby, 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 yeah, orange peel. <clears throat> what? The third thing was a monster. He'd tear apart any ordinary person crossing his path. Now he crashed in a darkness. Each part of it made at a different time. This game is very strange, and I don't even know if I'll understand it at the end of it. But at the end, he just mentioned Faden. I'm Jesse Faden. What are we doing? Explore the investigation sector. Okay, over here. This is active investigations. Uh oh. Oh, that's weird. Something in there dra it drains my energy. Uh, I don't feel right. Something in this darkness is draining me. Do you see that? Yeah. Shit. Now what? Oh, what's up, Cybot? It's existential horror time. You're right. Why hey, how's the audio that? sounding, you guys? How, how are you doing, Cy guy? Come on, elevator, time to go. Look at that thing. Hartman was desperate. Okay, he doesn't like light. Where is it? Where is it? Oh boy. I'm pretty good. Very sedated. Holy shit. <laughs> um, I'm good. I'm testing out this new controller. I've been I've been loving control puns, wordplay puns lately. I'm doing good. I'm fed. Ah, oh, shit! Did you hear that? He said. He said. He said, baby, baby, baby. 
the word he the, the phrase he said was included in in that so he didn't so this boss isn't saying baby 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 he's saying someone else said baby 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 which alan wake wrote about earlier this game is just freaky ice ice baby exactly i think that's exactly what this uh monster's talking about oh i'm gonna die Where does this one go? You guys see where? I'm so terrified right- AH! <sighs> okay, but now that we know, now that we know, we're not gonna- we're probably not gonna keep dying. I- I, I don't even get mad at dying because look at that- look at that screen. That death screen. Isn't that so pretty? You should see how it looks on my- on my- computer monitor it's just so it's really pretty look at that is it just blood in video games red mean you dead that's true for movies too right or not not always dead but it can mean danger i've been i've been wanting to watch more movies oh by the way I watched a movie yesterday. I went to the movies. I saw Tenet. I saw Tenet yesterday. It's kind of weird. It's kind of a mindfuck like this game is. Um, um, Robert Pattinson is in it. Although, I don't, I don't, it's, it's strange. He's just a, it's, the acting is very strange in this movie. You guys will have to see it for yourselves. You guys will have to see it for yourselves. Yeah, what about Persona 5? Ooh, I actually want to play that. I've, I've tried playing it a couple times, but then other games just captured my attention. Persona 5 is not bad. It's just other games. I, I just played other games instead, you know? I just want to see where this uh, these other cores are supposed to go. Over there, okay. The soundtrack is amazing, and now there's Persona 5 Royale. Um, should I? Is Persona 5 Royale on either Switch or PC? Oh no 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 no. Where was it? Where was it? Right there. The sirens in this game are really effective. Where, where, where? I saw it around here. I saw it. Ah, oh, shit. I saw it. I saw it. Where'd it go? Up here? Yeah, up here. Shit. I can't fly anymore. Shit. Come on, come on, come on. I'm frightened. Okay. Whew. One of the most entertaining... Okay. We have a few heat things in here. Uh, Royale is PS4. So is the original. Royale is a remake. One of the most entertaining movies I've seen was Uncut Gems. It's just Adam Sandler. Stop destructing from gambling addiction. I, I, I have not seen it in full. But I have been around while it was playing on a TV. <laughs> if that makes sense. Look at this thing. Yeah, 
All right, I completed Explore the Investigation Sector. Now it's time to do the objective Explore the Investigation Sector. You guys ready? Let's go. What are you doing in investigations? Jesus, don't scare me like that. If you're talking right now, I can't hear you. It's a one-way system. Try to find an intercom. Shut the hell up, Langston. Langston, it's me, Jesse. I know. I can see you on the monitors. The camera's okay. in there haven't worked since we sealed that sector off a couple years back. Let me guess. You sealed it because of the monster guy. Wait, did you see Dr. Hartman? Jesus, I really wish you hadn't opened that fire break. Damn. Okay, listen, you need to find Hartman and kill him before he gets out into the bureau. That thing is a person? He was I liked how person. one of my school we friends described it. Was, uh, it's just uh, Jewish uh, people screaming uh, at uh, each other. <laughs> That's I funny. The for what happened, there's, but, but there's, like there's a lot of him. black people in that movie too, right? Flashlight? Like, I, isn't there a basketball no. player? Kevin uh, Garnett? Uh, yeah. Headland. I think oh, yeah. a yeah. real oh, basketball yeah. player plays himself right. in that movie, Kevin Garnett. <laughs> I think that's hilarious. I've, okay. Like I said, I've seen, uh, I've seen it. Sure Not all of it, but I've, I'll I've been around <laughs> while it's on. Maybe from where you're standing. Right. Okay. Well, uh, break a leg. Oh, uh, why did I say that? Okay. This Hartman thing can't have gotten very far. Let's go flush him out. Hmm. Langston was right. This is kind of exciting. It's just nice to have someone to talk to, you know? Ever since I got put in charge of the Panopticon, people treat me different. Like I'm crazy for wanting to work with altered items. I think you are. Bye. I'm not talking to you. Is this where? Let's try it. All right, it's spooky scary time. It's actually time for spooky scaries. I'm actually, I'm actually anxious to proceed with this mission. Finally, I'm at a point in the game where I feel like I can push forward, but I'm also kind of scared to do so. Oh, I only have one ability point. I'm gonna max out either the health or this. Or C's. Ah, shit. Why am I dying so hard? Why am I dying so hard? Whoa. Damn it. Spooky, scary things everywhere around us. You know what? I used to have a catchphrase when I was young and edgy. I used to always say that. I wouldn't just say it out of nowhere, but I would just like write it in places. I used to be edgy and say things like death is all around us, but it's true. Everything dies, or everything is made up of other dead things. Oh shit. I used to be really, really edgy. Bye-bye. Um, oh, the light, the light. We need a powerful light. Look for a powerful light that I can carry. There we go. That's why you got to make the best of things. You're right, Mod. You're absolutely right. That kind of stuff. I used to I used to be really really depressed. I still get depressed once in a while, but I feel like depressed used to be my default setting. And uh You are 
mines. But yeah, I feel like depressed used to be my default setting. And now, uh... Now I just get depressed. Where are you at? Oh yeah? Okay, there was a powerful light around here somewhere. I think I threw it. I think I threw it. Yeah, I used to... So I used to get really depressed. Or I used to... Like I said, de depression used to be my default setting. And so... What would... Ha when I... When I was depressed all the time... Thinking about that is what got me... Kind of got me through it. Was... Hey... Everyone and everything is gonna die eventually. Nothing matters. So, so YOLO. So YOLO. So Drake it up, baby. Cybot says, I used to be scared that when I died, I would be in heaven for all eternity because I was in a Catholic home. That's fucking hilarious. You weren't s scared that you would go to hell. For eternity, you were scared you would go to heaven for all eternity. That's hilarious. You're like, uh, am I going to stay there forever? I never get to come back? I have to stay there? <laughs> I was like, bro, I want to be dead. Oh, so it would get repetitive. <laughs> That's just hilarious. It's like, bro, whether it's heaven or hell, I have to do that forever? Can I just, like, stop? When does it stop? When does the game, when is it game over? There has to be a game over. Imagine praising God every single moment of life forever. <laughs> it, the thing about the way that I feel about religion is if like you don't know if it's true so you're making a, a bet you're not and and I don't know I don't live my life like that oh hold on I need the light I don't live my life like that. However, however, I I find the phenomenon of religion very interesting because I don't think these people oh, shit. Did it break? I don't think people that are religious are religious for no reason. I feel like they're in touch with something. You know what I mean? They are... I don't know. I think there's something to be said for religion. Maybe. Or maybe not. Maybe there's not. But I find the phenomenon of religion... Very interesting. I knew it. A power core needs to go there. I need more power cores. And another light source. This is a light source, right? Whoops. Where did it go? Where'd the power core on it go?
Can I bring this with me? I can't. Uh, what if we just poof? Then it's just over. Darkness around you, nothing else. Yeah, that that would be. I feel like that would that would. <sighs> here's the thing. If we discover, if for some reason, here's here's maybe one of the benefits of religion. I want to be wrong about this, but here's the theory, on one of the benefits of religion existing. Okay. If somehow we can prove religion is not true, there is no God, yada, yada, yada. Um, doesn't that just kind of give some people the, like, okay to do really bad stuff? I mean, maybe not. Preferably not. You know, like if, like, like you and me, Cybot, might be good people, like decently normal people, well-rounded individuals. But what if, for some people out there, religion is like the only thing keeping them from, I don't know, being a murderer? By being very, I'm, maybe I'm being hyperbolic. Maybe I'm being very hyperbolic, but that could be right. That could be the case. I want to be. I want that to not be true because I'm not a religious person myself. It keeps them in check and gives them hope. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean. But I am not religious, and I can't be religious. I can't force myself to be religious. Where did it go? Is it not gonna let me bring lights down here? That's the second time it happened. It just disappears my lights. I am so confused. I am so confused. Mayhaps, but I think most humans are born with morality. But how? How so? Uh, and this something coming from someone who doesn't practice religion. I don't... I'm not religious. But yeah, maybe you're right about that, Saiba. Or maybe, do you think we are taught it? We witness morality and then we recreate it? Or, because... I mean, I don't know. I don't know how this works. I feel like the answer here is to move this thing. This game is strange. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Wait, is this it? Like this? Do I go... What am I supposed to do here? I think I'm obviously supposed to use the light to get rid of these things. Alright, there's a powerful light. Let's try it again. Okay, let's try it again. Yeah, I think I think maybe religion has its uses, but at the same time historically, historically, maybe not today or perhaps today as well. But historically religion has its bad stuffs too, right? Damn it. 
Do you see that? She even says, damn it. She even says, damn it. But it spawns another light. What am I supposed to do here? Isn't this strange? Why does that keep happening? That's so fucking strange. Wait a minute. Oh no, okay. I think I get it. I'm, I'm so fucking stupid. Okay, I think I know. Watch this. It's not going to possibly only give me one chance to do it. this a good angle? There we go. Look at that. Uh, do I play Magic the Gathering? I do not. I do not. Oh shit, he's there. Oh shit, that's frightening. No, it's not. Stick to the lights. thought B-word. This has to go somewhere. <laughs> Come on. Where would this go? Where would this go? Are you fucking serious? There's no end. What I love about this game is there's no way for you to get health unless you kill things. And there's nothing here for me to kill. There's nothing here for me to kill.
Right here. You don't heal after a long time. You have to kill something in order to heal. Come on, just grab it! Holy shit, just grab it. Eat shit, bitch. Oh my god. I don't think he's dead. I don't think he's dead. Maybe? Let me check something. You have me curious, Mud. You have me curious. What was I going to look at? Oh, I can't look at it here. But I'm wondering if I upgrade the health all the way. If that means it will give me, like, health regeneration. Probably does. Oh, and, and finding one of those control points heals you. I, I always forget that. Finding a control point heals you. Oh, look, we have friends down there. Those guys look friendly, right? Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Why am I almost dead? Are you fucking serious? These at the... Okay. Oh, this just gives me more health. I don't think it'll give me... Regeneration. Does anyone have any idea what this thing is saying? Hotly, Dirt arranged you. Why are you what? here? What the hell do you want? Why'd you stow away on that ship? School bearing boy boy. Eyes many cauterizing loops through and about. When did Mildy Mitchell? Did he just say Mitchell? Was there a Mitchell at NASA? Oops. You know what? Never mind. I can't do this anymore. Just send this thing to the guys in research. Let them cut it up or whatever they do. You hear Jeez. that? They're gonna cut you up, you pain in the ass. Spider time. Spider time. Spider time. You son of a b-word. Why did that take so long? We're full on mods. I need to start selling my level threes. And level twos. We'll keep fours for now. Twos and threes to sell.
Why is he healing so quickly? What does the game expect me to do? Like, I know there's a thing healing him. But look at he's all the way full, bitch. I should be able to kill him, dude. Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious right now? I should be able to kill that thing. I I understand he's being healed by another thing, but that thing isn't around me. That's a stupid expectation. We were going this way. It's a really stupid expectation. Spider time. by me. Do you hear them screaming bloody murder? It's fucking terrifying. Oh shit, there's a sniper. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Christ, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> nope, can't take this light source. It's too heavy for Jesse Faden. God damn it. I feel like... the time. Look at these things, dude. Oh! I'm really getting sniped out here. Fall damage. I died from fall damage. <sighs> okay, come on. Come on, Ooze Pop. Come on. Focus. You're not gonna let this game get the better of you. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. Control. You will. 
be beaten by me. Do you hear me? We're not going to let this game... We're not going to let control win control over me. Are you listening to me? It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. This is the one, baby. This is the one. This is the one. Come on. Come on. Come on. This is the one. Spider time. Spider time. Alright, we need to find that thing that's healing him first. There it is. We need to kill that sniper bitch. Fuck you, bitch. I'm literally about to fucking die with nothing to do. That sniper is really, really inconvenient. Fuck you! Fuck you! Now you guys can die. I had to I had to rush that quickly. It's difficult. The answer to that problem is be fast. Come on, come on. I need you. God. Come on. Ah, this is this one's frustrating and it's weird. This feels like a difficulty spike. The game has not been this hard. The game has not been this hard. Usually I die once or twice. Um, yeah, it's like part of, if you have nothing to grab, <coughs> excuse me, I noticed that <coughs> if you have nothing <coughs> to grab, you'll just grab the wall. See that? You'll grab whatever is nearest you. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. You'll grab whatever is nearest you and... If there's nothing, it'll just grab the ground. Hold on now. So this part's challenging, friends. We're gonna have to be quick about it. Yeah, this, this game has really good physics. I really like that. This game feels good. The button presses happen went exactly perfectly. I press a button and it does it immediately. Um, take this one over. We're gonna play the long game here. We're playing the long game. Come on, come on, come on. That thing should be dead. It's not dead? Where is it? That thing should be dead. There we go, baby. Come on. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Son of a bitch. Fuck off, bitches. I'm going to create an army of these things. Whew. 
That guy's gonna throw shit at me, and this guy's gonna snipe me. Two snipers? Son of a bitch. There we go. Get the bridge moving. Come on, come on, come on. You are mine. Immediately. Oh, God, you. Guy. I think he spawns other things. I think he spawns other things. This game is just so frightening. This game is so frightening. This game is so frightening. So anxiety inducing. Your mind? Get that other one. Are we done? Are we done with this bridge bullshit? I think we are. Okay, cool. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it, chat. That was tough. Okay, so down here? I'm guessing? Yeah, yeah, down here. Okay. You guys think this game isn't a mind fuck? Look at this. Look at this. Look at these stairs. It's like reality is solidly collapsing. Do you see this? Hello? <laughs> All right, looks like I'm gonna need a light source. Over here. <laughs> All right, here we go. This game's actually kind of fun. All right, which opens this door. And wouldn't you know it, the only purpose of this door is that there is a light source. That was the only purpose of the door. I feel like this whole house is a test. A mint. Uh, the environment designs are much like the ones from the game I played, Nascent's E. Oh, I looked that game up, actually. I, I, I thought that game, Nascent's E, I had it mistaken for another game, but it still looks really good. Looks like whatever force had a hold on Hartman isn't mixing well with the his corruption. All right, let's see. Like. Did Never. call him the third thing. Always. Listen to Langston. Never, never. But isn't a stranger just someone you don't know? Okay. What if the only thing stopping a stranger from being a friend is that word? Stranger. Strange. What? <clears throat> Langston, you're weird. You are strange. Games like the noises you hear at yeah, it's night definitely the game that showed me no games life. could be pretty amazing. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, it's a it's strange like a rubber I... duck that follows you around. Oh, he mentioned the rubber duck. Makes you drop your coffee every time that it quacks. 
because the noise scares you. Then you have to clean up the coffee while the duck stares at you and continues to quack, quack, okay. quack, quack. That was weird. Um, yeah, I love video games, Cybot, that remind me. Like, that games, like, sure, games are about having fun, and games are, are competitive and whatnot, but sometimes... Whoa. Sometimes it doesn't have to be, though. Sometimes it can be an art, artistic experience. Um, Death Stranding was very much that way. A chain letter. <laughs> I remember these. Mom used to say they were evil. Hmm. Well, we won't do it yet. Apartment. Better do what it says. You know. Just, just in case. case. There must be a photocopier around here. All right, we're collecting lots of lore. Send a ranger out. Director's orders. The hiss are in for it now. <laughs> Bye, guys. Shit, the grenades. Shit. Take a run for it this way. Yeah! You wanna get. Oh! Shit, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. No. Not if I can help it! I like how when you capture them, they drop some health. That's really helpful. Not very much. But it's better than zero. I got him. See any more? Why is this one so tough? Ah! B word? There we go. Oh my god, no, 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 no. I apologize. I apologize. That thing's tough. was very difficult. 
So, random question to anybody watching. How's COVID treating your life at the moment? Is life getting back to normal for you guys? Are we still in lockdown? <clears throat> How, how, how are our lives doing? Let's see here. I have to somehow get this way. Down here? Yeah, this is the way. This is the way. Uh, for me, our town is really trying to get back to normal. Really, really trying to get back to normal. Um, oh shit, these things. Yeah, I still don't know what those are. Can't traverse them yet. At least I don't think I can. But, uh... Yeah, my, my, my town seems to be trying its hardest to be back to normal. Restaurants are open. The movies are open. Like I said, I went to the movies yesterday. I saw Tenet. Pretty, pretty decent film. It was, it was strange. A little confusing, but... But... Pretty satisfying. Pretty well satisfying. Hmm. Now let's go back. I like the idea of going. Let's go this way. Let's go this way. Um. The U.S. has passed 200,000 deaths for coronavirus. In case you guys didn't know. Okay, we made it. We made it. You can see him. You can just see him there. He's just standing there. Menacingly. FRA? Remember a word. Okay, I'm, I apologize. I apologize. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Jesus Christ! Please! Lord God, help me. Well, I need some light to get other light. Oh, come on. I'm really gonna die. Oh god, that's so terrifying. Dude, I'm going to die. Okay, <clears throat> there's got to be some sort of strategy here. There's got to be some sort of strategy here. Uh, moving target is harder to hit. Keep moving to avoid enemy fire and sustain less damage. Okay, let's... Let's try this again. Let's try it again. Oh boy. Oh boy. Big time. Big time rush here. Fuck. 
shit. You hear his creepy ass being creepy? But you see they're locked. I guess that's fair. Fair is fair. Fair is fair, game. I legit don't know what to do here. Oh, there, there is one. How did that get free? <clears throat> That's, I don't understand. Is it already free or did it become free? Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Oh man, I am getting a headache if I do say so myself. It's not like anyone else can say it. Imagine if someone else could say, hey man, you're getting a headache. Wouldn't that be kind of silly? Son of a bitch! What am I supposed to do? I can't even, like, grab it. I can't even grab it. I can't grab it. I just have to let it kill me. Holy shit, what the fuck? I don't even understand how this game- There's no difficulty settings in this game. Some parts of this game- or at least the Alan Wake part of this game is very trial and error. Kind of breaking the flow of the game a little bit. Where is it? I thought there was a light over here. It looked like there was a light over here. This is actually becoming irritating now. <clears throat> this is one single mission we've been doing. One single mission. I just want to finish this objective. That's all. Where is it? What the heck?
do not get. Son of a bitch, dude. Okay, where's the third one? I don't even know where it's located. I think it's gonna keep my progress updated. This mission's kind of stupid. <clears throat> Named enemies present a tougher challenge, but yield rewards. Oh, cool, okay. I didn't see this before. I didn't see this before. Okay. We <laughs> ran away again. There. Mod forty one thirty says, I'm back yeah. Gerbil took the top head. Um, you, you just missed me dying many, many times. All right, now hold on real quick. the cell intercom there's an intercom in here for us to use uh, this creature's falling 
through light. Yeah, the, the this creature doesn't like the light. Hello? I didn't do that. Cell intercom. Yes, hello. Yes, me? Worry who? Oh. Hello? Hello. Great about us today. Long roads and no hardly. You are bygone? Uh, sure. Why are you locked up in here? Ah, uh, casual turning. Back and front. And <laughs> Gerbil took the top head. Not being pressed for that. Lady going and loosing back for I? Sorry, what? I, I think I'm misunderstanding you. What do you want? The head. The head for tails. For reading news, jars, words, and tumble. The reading head. Okay, okay, take it easy. I'll, uh, I'll take a look. The reading head. So maybe it wants something to read. Or a jar. Let's just see what we can find. Excuse me. The reading head. Help me find the reading head. Yeah, this guy is weird, right? Staged moon landing. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. This could be what it wants. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, look at this is where they staged the moon landing. That's just casually there. <laughs> Mod, you're silly. You're funny. Scotch and peppers? Head. Okay, I wasn't right. Let's try something else. Gasps in American. Maybe it'll like this. The gerbil took the top head. Keep trying. A S B E. Twink one two two three three three. Pancake became super handsome. Oh hey Twink, how are you? Welcome back to the stream. We haven't seen you in a while. Yep, I'm Pancake. I'm Pancake the Rabbit Boy. A S B E head. SBE head. Uh, life been hell and have not had much free time to chill. And when I do, I just sleep. Oh, I'm really sorry to hear that, Twink. Maybe upstairs. Um, are you relaxing right now? It, do we at least have a, a small breather right now it's okay how how do you how have y'all been same old same old I got a new job ah, god my arm hurts I got a new job no not here we're in a whole other area now um I'm still streaming as usual. Yay, yay, yay. Thank you, thank you. My arm is hurting. I hope I'm not about to have a stroke. My left arm is hurting. I need to eat better, you guys. I definitely need to eat better. What does this guy want, though? Head. The reading head. Should we try here again? Try these areas again? Oh! 
maybe this will do the trick. Is that it? Oh, I have to go at a certain point. I'm actually going to be turning this off Who's relatively soon, that? too. Yes, that wasn't it either. Uh. Come on. What does this guy want? This? This might do it. I'm just going back and forth. Come on. Brady, you are school and dirt for losing. Keep that up and I won't help you anymore. Yeah, I'm probably going to end relatively soon. Not right away, but relatively soon. What's that? Let's see if this will do it. <sighs> I'm ready to be done with this. Holy shit, what is happening? Hurry, clocks, lady. The head. 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 No snacks. Head is top of all up and down. Wait, does this thing actually mean head? Head is in a body's head? Where the hell am I gonna find that? And how did it lose it? <laughs> That's a good question. Um, I'm actually just killing a few minutes as I wait for my appointment to start, so that works. Well, I appreciate you stopping by, Twink. It's been a while since we've seen you. And yeah, pancake. Pancake is still pancake. Don't worry. How am I? Sector head office. Sector head office. Let's see. Will I be able to complete this? I'm going to see if I can complete. Oh. Y'all see this shit? Defeat the hiss enemy. Is that her breathing? <laughs> oh, this guy's a tough one. Son of a shotch. <laughs> That's thinking with your head. I don't know much about rabbits, but I have heard they can just be gone suddenly. Yeah, some some rabbits, yeah, ha have issues. Um, pancakes good. I think I I theorize he might have sinus problems because when we give him food, it takes him a while to find it. I don't think he's blind. I think he has sinus issues. Uh, you no, know, he's alive, but but for some reason, so the reason I have the webcam on me now, Twink, is there's there's two reasons. The main reason being we have a new desk. Before I didn't have a desk, my computer was hooked up to a TV on an entertainment center. Now that I have a desk, the webcam can be pointed at me. Reason number two, if I were to have the webcam on Pancake. It would be really ugly because for some reason he's developed a new habit of kicking his litter and shit out of the cage nonstop. It's been quite frustrating. Yeah, it's been quite frustrating. All right, we need to find the head. Is that the head? A helmet. For a head. Is that what the prisoner meant? I guess there's only one way to find out. Alright, let's give the prisoner its head and see if this was the right, right thing to do. 
let's see. It all adds up. <laughs> That's so fun to clean. Yeah, no, it's annoying. He's really, really annoying. I have no idea why he does it. He's never done it before in his life. We have no idea why he's just started to do it. But he's a he's a big old brat. Chicken station. <laughs> Far tastier. Press any button. So the helmet is what you're after, huh? Tubes, snug and grape, pure grapes. Hello, lady. You're welcome, I guess. Did Kirkland lock you up in here? Kirkland. She's trouble? Yes. Teddy's long around. But hold out an happiest. Can gather for goldfishes. No wrinkle. That okay. must be one of the crew from the fake well, moon landings. Maybe. Like you're doing fine in there now. Just Yeah, I think so. Make sure you don't go anywhere. Jelly. He's a well, jelly. Help this guy. I think. Best we leave it locked up though. We have no idea what it is and we don't need any more problems out here. Okay, Jesse. All right. I think our next mission will be this. So I'm gonna fast. Oh, whoops! I'm gonna fast travel there just so we're ready to do it, and I'm gonna end the control segment. Maybe I'll watch like a couple YouTube videos or something. Maybe not. Maybe we'll just end up. Maybe we'll end. What is this game? It's Control. It is Control. Operation Center. Let's go here. Are you gonna stream again today? Maybe I'll stream again later tonight. Um, I have, I have work in a little bit. Um, so maybe I'll stream again later tonight. Um, but perhaps not. Maybe we shall see. If I do stream again later tonight, it will be very short stream, one or two hours. I have to go, but nice to chat and see you for once. Thank you for stopping by, Twink. It was good seeing you in chat again. Very good seeing you. Oh, whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Okay. For the rest of you guys, sorry. I, was, I have a big mess here. I had a very rushed morning. Okay. So, for everyone else, thank you for stopping by. Let me let me just really quickly. Here we go. And let's find someone to raid. I don't think I'll make it hanging here another day. I, I wanna get spirited away. Every time I'm near it, I run clear the other way. And disappear and never stay. Spirited oh, Goob's away. watching the PS5 I don't event. Think I'm here another day. I wanna get spirited away. I run clear the other yeah, let's raid Goobula. Way. 